Johnny Thrash from 106.3 The Buzz along with Dale and Brian from Seether out to hip in the new album, Isolate Medicaid, due out July 1st. We're just weapon, the current single, doing pretty well for you. How have these festivals been going for you so far? Uh, they've been great, man. You know, we, uh, we've taken a lot of time off, so... You know, you, you don't know how it's going to be when you when you come back. You, you know, you kind of hope people haven't forgotten about you, but I think it's it's kind of been the opposite. I think uh, we toured so hard for so long. It was just it was just a given that we'd be on pretty much all the festivals in the summer. And uh, I think because we missed a few, you know, people are excited to see us again. So I think it's I think it's good to take a break every now and again and yeah. step away and you know create a bit of a bit of want again for, for the band. So yeah, I get that buzz great. Going. Yeah, it gets a good buzz going yeah, for yeah, you, yeah. you know, I mean, uh, obviously, the last one did well, and it seems like pretty much everything you do does well, so you're, you have the formula down for sure. Um, as far as the new album, though, Al, that's what people are thinking about. Is the Rock and crowd tonight going to get treated to anything other than words as weapons, or...? Um, you know, we, we're trying to stay away from playing the, the new stuff. Um, We'd love to play it, you know, because we, we love the songs. That, you know, it's always exciting to have new material, but um, we don't want to ruin the surprise. Yeah. You know, yeah. if, and if we played a new song, there'd be some really low quality cell phone version of it on YouTube by the end of the night, you know. So, yeah. uh, we want the first time people hear the new stuff to be how it's intended, you know, on the album and, and recorded in good quality. So, um, we, we'd love to, but we, we just we want to we just want to wait. As soon as it drops, we'll we'll start playing some of the some of the newer stuff. Yeah, yeah that, that's smart. So, did y'all did y'all did Carolina Rebellion too? All right, and Rock on the uh, Range. We did. Yeah. Y'all did both of those. Yeah. Now. They're talking about this one being fifty thousand plus. Would that would that be the biggest? I would imagine of, of the, the loudest month right. so far. Yeah, yeah, so far, yeah. Previous, uh, yeah, uh, Rocklahoma. Or we're we're doing Rocklahoma. <laughs> <laughs> I think trust all. Yeah, yeah. I know. You're rolling, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where are we today? Yeah. Um, yeah. No, what was the the last one we did? Uh, I think the, I think Rock on the Range. Rock on the Range, yeah, that was about forty thousand, yeah, so, or thirty eight plus. Uh, that so was the biggest uh, so far until this one today. Yeah, so, this is huge. Yeah, and that was a great crowd. I'm sure this is going to be a great crowd as well. So, you know. this one, this is um now this will be the biggest Rock Oklahoma also. In addition to the fact there's probably going to be the biggest of the loudest month. Uh, this is this your first Rock Oklahoma, or have y'all done uh, it before? No, no, we've done it before actually. Um, we we're just joking about it earlier, Sean. Last time we had Sean stole a golf cart and uh, got taken down by the cops and they were going to haul him in for like, I don't know, grand theft or whatever. And eventually they're like, okay, just you know, get on your bus and behave. Okay, fine. But, but yeah, it's, so we, we, we got... We, we got some history here. Yeah. yeah. I can see see the head of security and those guys kind of eyeballing when he walked in. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah, because it's the same people. Oh yeah. I mean, oh, yeah. you walk, you drive up, you're like, hey, you yeah. were right there. I was like, I just yeah. left a yeah. while ago, man. <laughs> it is a lot of fun, though. I tell you, the good thing about these festivals is they're making it more modern now. Yeah. Rock Home in particular, you know, for years it came up uh, a modern rock station like us. We couldn't really do anything with it because it was all like '80s hair bands and stuff yeah. like that. In the last couple of years, they've really went with up-to-date and relevant artists yeah. and of course see they're one of the biggest of the last decade and hopefully that run will continue for y'all man thank you and uh y'all have yourselves a kick-ass set tonight look forward oh, yeah. to it thanks a lot thank, thank y'all so man cheers all right man appreciate y'all